first time ever they're gonna try and launch this thing down the launch ramp. Never seen this boat put in with the uh, by the launch ramp, so it'll be interesting. Well, as you can see, Boogaboo's on the trailer. Now, normally they take it by trailer from our um, land station, shall we say, over to the travel lift, but which is behind me over there. But this year, for the first time ever, they're going to try and launch us at the actual launch ramp, just drive it down the ramp. So we'll see how that works and how well the uh, Boogaboo fares. So let's let's follow along, shall we? Well, she's very tight coming around that corner with that tree. Got to get a couple more vehicles out of the way and he should be all right. Right, honey? Exciting day? Exciting day? It's always a good day when the boat goes in the water. So here we are, hoo hoo, we're in the water, we have success. Uh, clearly got by that structure up there with no problem, that was my only concern, uh, well, and that of Anchor Girl as well, because the launch ramp is right there, and as you can see that balcony sticks out quite a ways, and we thought maybe it would be a little tight for the uh, canvas on the flybridge of Boogaboo, but it was all good, driver did an awesome job, uh, all hands on deck, the staff here so far are, uh, our um, experience has been really good, top-notch service. And uh, just to give you a quick example of that, if you can hear me over the uh, sound of the wind, uh, as soon as the boat was lifted up on that travel lift and driven away, there was a truck, two kids over there, immediately picking up all the blocking and the, the jack stands and whatnot, taking it away. Um, I dare not speculate on how long that would have st <laughs> stood there in that position with the uh, previous crew. But anyways, that said, we are in the water, we're floating, and it's hoo-ha. Now, right now, we are just temporarily gonna stay at this dock simply because um, there's a number of, as there is every spring, as you can imagine, leaks in the water system. So everything's gonna be tightened up and fixed and patched. So until such time, the only water that's available, running water in the marina, is coming from the main building. And there is a, uh, uh, hose bib right on the side of the building so we'll just run our lines and start doing our uh, summarizing of the water system filling up the fresh water tank getting the turlets flushing and with any luck we'll be spending our first night aboard Boogaboo tonight and today is the 6th of May 2015 so still a relatively late um, launch for our boats anyways but uh, a lot earlier than last year. Last year we were in the water May 12th, I believe it was. So we're nearly a full week ahead of the game and uh, ahead of the long weekend because the Victoria Day long weekend, which is Memorial Day in the States, is not this coming weekend, but the weekend after. So we'll be here for the long weekend. We're going to be here tonight and uh, probably uh, maybe not tomorrow night, but from then on. What am I talking about? Yeah, tomorrow's Thursday, which is the new Friday. Yeah. 
Yeah, like I say, what am I talking about? Tomorrow's Thursday, which of course everybody knows is the new Friday. So yeah, we'll be here tomorrow and then uh, from henceforth, hoo-ha, we will be calling Boogaboo home again for the season, which is super fantastic. We have a glorious day. It is warm, as you can see, t-shirt weather, just a light breeze, just enough to make it comfortable and air the boat out. And so I'm happy. I'm smiling. We are in the water. Who freaking ha. Ah. So it is the end of day one. Not even officially the full day one, but our day one of launch, shall we say. May 6, 2015. And we have been enjoying uh, a beautiful late afternoon, early evening. Just finished up some supper. I uh, got the uh, fresh water system all flushed and that's humming, toilets going and it's so nice to hear that of the vacuum flush toilets going again. If you got one you know what I mean, especially after this long winter. And yes, I know we were in Florida for two months but we came back the end of February and man oh man the last two months have been challenging shall we say with the, uh, with the weather. Uh, but that's all behind us now and we are back on the water and we are back living on the boat our true home back on boogaboo and that is so awesome and so cool um i'm sure that if these folks behind me had an opportunity <laughs> to see this video they'd be a little bit jealous because they're still up in the air but uh yeah it's uh we're a week ahead i think i mentioned this already of uh, our launch last year a little bit later than normal but at this point i'm just happy to be back on the boat back on the water living aboard we're going to spend tonight on the boat this will be our first night back aboard for 2015 and it's going to be great we're not 100 percent set up but who cares it doesn't matter we'll get the rest of the stuff uh going over the weekend and we will be fully fully back at home and like i say this is our true home so i just got to show you what it looks like because it's deadly calm a beautiful evening that is uh, coming to us about 7 30 almost eight o'clock and it is awesome and beautiful and we are really really looking forward to this season uh, new management here at the marina a new group managing the place and um, so far so good really good so we're looking forward to all the goodness that's going to come so i hope you uh, keep following along as it pan back around into the bright sunshine of this beautiful day and uh, again Thanks for following, thanks for watching, and thank you from Boogaboo. Cheers.